Hey guys, Aaron here of Apple Updates with a video explaining to you guys why you should not install OS X Mavericks. So, first of all, um, as you know, a few weeks ago at WWDC, Apple announced, um, along with a few other cool things, um, the new um, OS X operating system. So now, of course, at first look, everything looks good, but there are some things that you don't know about it um, that, in my opinion, um, should hold you back from uh, downloading it until at least um, it is officially released. First thing um, is that some of the uh, features, like the notifications uh, on your iOS device, um, to your notifications in the operating system won't work. Another thing uh, is that once you um, download and uh, and install um, the iCloud keychain over here, all your passwords um, will be saved and Apple is still in these stages of really encrypting uh, your kind of your passwords and stuff so um, it's not really um, such a great uh, idea to kind of trust them yet with all your passwords because um, as you know Mavericks has not been publicly uh, launched yet so um, there are going to be uh, a few uh, glitches including performance glitches um, I find I have Mavericks uh, but it's just impossible to make a screen recording with QuickTime because it is just so buggy and um, you know, it's it's just a pain to um, to use. Um, now, I do have Mavericks um, installed on a different partition, so I don't know. Maybe that could be the cause. But um, other than that, um, I really recommend that you guys hold off on uh, downloading and installing. Um, Mavericks because you know it could really mess up your system and you can't revert back so at least wait till um, Apple launches it publicly um, and not just to uh, developers to uh, install it. This has been an Apple Updates video and as always have a great